let's try that again. All right, bet. So recording now? I hope so. All right, cool. All right, so I was like, who can I bring on this? You know, who's gonna bring fire to my team? Who's gonna go ahead and give the same value that I gave y'all last time? So I pulled a few strings, you know, I went out, I, I, I was ducking, I was weaving, I was like, who can I bring, right? So ladies and gentlemen, I want y'all, it's the same energy y'all gave me. I want you to drop, what do I want to drop? Let me see some money bags in the chat. I want you to drop some money bags in the chat right now because we about to go crazy. We about to make some money. Uh, hello, money bags, there they come. There we got one, there we go, we got some more. Yeah, there we go, money bags, money bags, money bags, money bags, money bags, money bags, let's go. Let me see the money bags. Y'all don't drop money bags. You good, you straight. All right, bet. So ladies and gentlemen, I want y'all to give a warm welcome to P5000, Platinum 5000, Kobe. Y'all, let's go. Round of applause. Let's go. There he go. All right, hold on, Kobe. I forgot. Let me make you, I lied, JK. Hold on, let me make you host. Then we can congrats. Let me, then we can try that again. JK, hold on. All right, now let's go ahead and, and, and give a warm welcome to Kobe, ladies and gentlemen. Is he hosting? Yo, what's good? How we living? How we live? How we living, Nat? How we living? I'll show you my screen so they can see. I got you. Hold on. How we living? Oh, there you go. There you go. We living. We living lavish over here. How you doing? Man, you know how we living. We always good. We always living. Always living straight. Always blessed. But yo, what's good, family? How we living? How we living? Hope everyone's having a blessed day. I'm gonna go ahead and pin my video just in case my face isn't here, right? But um, you know, I want to give it back to Nat, you know, uh, Natalia, I've been talking to her a little bit. Um, I actually reached out to her, I want to say back in August, and I was really just uh, like, I, I saw her content, she was really consistent. I didn't follow her or anything like that, but I just, I, I kept, she kept popping up on my feed. I was like, who is this? I don't know who this is. I don't know. I've never seen her before. I don't know. I, I was just like, I was confused. I was like, I gave her a follow. And, you know, I, I know she in the trenches because she she hit me with a script. She was she was trying to get me on the squad. I said, man, I'm already hit P5. <laughs> I was like, hold on. But no, nah, like, uh, you know, when we when we first got on, the uh, you know, in the DMs, we was talking, you know, I seen how she how consistent she was. You know, she she was just getting into the whole YouTube thing. She was sending me YouTube videos, having me try to, you know, getting me to go watch them and stuff. You know, I said try, I'm gonna go ahead and hit my push-ups. Don't worry. I know how y'all work, right? I, I know how y'all team works. So I'm gonna hit my push-ups. But um, you know, uh I, I really just been peeping, you know, and the consistency that she has and you know, the things that I, I've just been peeping on social media, you know, is is phenomenal. You know, you're 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 definitely with, you know, the right type of individual. Um, within this business, right? So, you know, she, she actually reached out to me when I was doing an HFX session, I want to say a week and a half, two weeks ago, um, you know, just hopped on the session. And if I don't, if I'm not mistaken, let me know in the, uh, not, let me know, let me know in the chat, you know, if we made money on that session. I'm not, I'm not necessarily sure if we made money, right? But just let me know in the chat if we made money on that session. I'm pretty sure that we did. I, I'm 99% I'm, I'm sure that we, we went undefeated on that session right? Big bags, right? So, you know, we, we hold, you know, my organization, we hold sessions a lot, um, especially in the morning. Um, but, you know, she was on the session, she made money, she saw value, you know, so she asked me to go ahead and, you know, be on this call with y'all. And, you know, I was, I was excited, you know, I'm excited to always do calls and, and help others and such, you know, I have no one on my team here. Um, you know, I'm seriously just, you know, I'm just here to help y'all in whatever way that I can give value and such. Um, if at any moment, any point, you know, I start to lag out or anything like that, just let me know. I'm um, in the chat, but uh, I know that y'all had a training. So basically, I'm going to do a tiny, tiny, tiny run through. I'm going to give you some of the things that I look for. I'm, gonna, I'm basically going to give you, you know, kind of my analysis, how I go about it. And, you know, we're going to look for a bag. We're going to look for some trades, right? So, you know, we trade cash trap. If you did not know, um, this is a cash trap, you know, session. So I would think that y'all know that. Um, but, you know, let's go ahead and get into it, right? So I'm going to go ahead and share my screen. Sheesh, sheesh, sheesh. But if you see my screen real quick, you know, just drop some sevens in the chat. I just want to double check, make sure everything is solid. So let me know. Let me know. Cool, cool, cool. Seven, seven, seven. Bet perfect. Right, family? So this is Cash Trap. Let me make my phone on Do Not Disturb. We don't need any distractions. Um, and, you know, this is the this is the hourglass. You know, this is where we get access to Cash Trap and such. 
Um, and if you know the confirmations, you know, you, you should know basically the, the idea of what we're looking for, right? So me personally, I don't take trades unless it meets my confirmations and things look right in my eyes, right? So if things don't look right, I don't take the trade. I'm a very conservative trader and I don't like to gamble. I like to win, okay? I'd rather miss a trade than lose money, okay? So with that being said, you know, I, I, I tend to look for ideas that, you know, make sense, make the most sense, right? So the things that I use, you know, the confirmations is of course, the arrow that Hourglass gives us, right? Um, if you, you, you know, you've learned the, the entire strategy, you know, we look for, you know, price to bounce off of our Bollinger Bands, right? These little, uh, you know, red three lines up here, um, and these little blue three lines down there, right? We look majority for, you know, bounce off of those, those Bollinger Bands. It gives you more confidence. It gives you more, you know, uh, you know, uh, confirmation and analysis and such, right? Um, as well as that, you know, we come down to, you know, our two indicators down here and it's, it's the same concept, you know, if price comes below the blue dotted line and starts to make a reversal to the upside, you know, we're looking for a buying situation. If price comes above the red dotted lines, um, we're looking for a reversal and, you know, we're looking for that downside, right? That put same thing for this confirmation down there, right? Um, one confirmation that I typically use, um, I've, you know, I've been on a few trainings with some people, they don't use this confirmation, some do. Um, but when you're on, you know, that this section of hourglass, right, this main section here, you know, you have this purple, uh, this purple line, this purple uh, uh, MA, MA line, moving average, right? Um, what I typically do is try to move away from the purple line, okay? I call it my opposition, my op, right? We don't like ops, okay? So we move away from ops, okay? That's that's just one of my rules. So I'm more, majority of the time looking for trades that are gonna be going in the opposite direction of this purple line, okay? And then the last confirmation that I typically look for is strength. Um, if you want this website, I don't know if y'all have it. I don't know if y'all use it. This is the one that I use um, for, uh, currency strength, y'all can have that, right? But we look for currency strength. If you don't know how currency strength works, I'll break it down to you real quick, okay? So basically, what we're looking to happen, right? Let's say that we're gonna look at, let's say that we're gonna look at USD CAD, okay? So USD CAD, right? We're just gonna write on the screen real quick. Uh, I don't like how that's positioned. Let me move that down a little bit, right? So we're looking at USD CAD. Um, Basically, we're looking at strength. So the more bars that it has, the more strength that it has. So USD at this very moment has three bars, meaning we have three bars of strength, right? We look at CAD, the Canadian dollar, right? We only have one bar of strength. That is three to one, meaning the US dollar is stronger than the Canadian dollar, which means major majority of the time we're gonna be looking for buying situations, okay? If we're looking at USD CAD and it's this type of situation here where the first pair is stronger than the second pair, we're looking for buying situations, okay? So vice versa, right? Let's say that we're looking at, um, let's say Euro JPY, okay? We're looking at Euro JPY. I'm just doing a quick rundown for y'all too, family. So Euro JPY, right? So in this case here, we have our Euro, which has two bars of strength, right? And then we have our Japanese Yen, which has one, two, five bars of strength, okay? So Euro has two, JPY has five. The Japanese Yen is stronger, meaning if we were to look at this pair here, we're looking for selling opportunities, okay? I'm gonna give you my personal uh, uh, opinion about trading. Um, when I trade, if the currency strength meter is not going along with my analysis, I don't take the trade, okay? I, I need to be confident in currency strength, okay? Um, and basically that's it, you know, sometimes I'll get into some type of uh, support and resistance and such, but for the most part, that's, that's, that's how I trade, right? Um, but, you know, since I kind of ran through it, you know, let's go ahead and get into a bag. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna play music um, and I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna get in my little, my little mode, my little zone. I've already been looking at the markets a little bit um, and, and getting prepared. Now I just need to make sure, you know, uh, we're good. Um, I saw Natalia playing some, you know, some Wayne and, and, and Meek at the beginning, you know, getting everyone fired up. But, you know, I like to give the audience, you know, the choice of music. If you want to give me some type of artist, I'll go on YouTube and listen to an artist, whoever y'all want to listen to. I just need someone to beat that I can kind of bop my head to. That's all I really need. Pop smoke. <laughs> Romeo Santos. I don't know who that is. I'm be honest with you. Kodak, A Boogie, Tim McGraw, No Cap. <laughs> Y'all are funny. Okay, but I'm gonna put on. I've been listening to Kodak in a minute. I'm gonna put on Kodak. 
right? Y'all, y'all, aren't y'all a Florida squad? Y'all probably like Kodak. <laughs> I'm gonna put, I'm gonna put Kodak on. Let me see. We'll do. We're gonna do. Oh, if y'all building the business, y'all want a little, a little tip, something I can give you. Go study Riyad Jones on, on, on YouTube. Is gas. I'm gonna just let you know if you're building this business, go study Riyad Jones. That's that right there is gonna help you on a lot. Um, but we're gonna put on, we'll put on Skrilla. All right. So we got about two more minutes until the next candle pops up. So we just gonna put on this. Let me make sure my sound is on so y'all can hear. Bet. All right, so I'm looking at USD CAD. Um, we got a little bit of strength on the USD side, so it's giving us more confirmation towards buys. Um, in my personal opinion, I like big differences in price, um, or sorry, in strength. Um, but you know, other than that little thing, I mean, we're still stronger in strength. We still have th a three to two comparison, you know, upgraded or uh, updated and everything. We're near a Bollinger Band. We're underneath, um, you know, our blue lines on both, you know, uh, indicators. We're going to, in the opposite direction of the op. Um, so in my personal opinion, you know, it looks, it looks smooth, you know, in what I'm thinking, you know, might happen with this trade is we might have to wait until this next candle. Um, I know this candle just opened, but in my personal opinion, you know, I, I, I like I said, I like to play the safe side of things. And I think that this might drop a little bit more um, before it actually makes a move. Um, but, you know, I'm gonna kind of just peep it, kind of look uh, to see what is happening within the market. So make sure you go to your brokers, whatever, you know, you're using, whether it's race option, whether it's, um, VD Forex, whether it's uh, IQ Cent, uh, pocket option. If you got pocket option, you know, do what you can to get away from that because pocket option is not it. But, you know, ooh, I don't like USD CAD's payout, though. That's 66%. What's the, what, what's the payout for USD CAD on y'all's brokers? What's the, what's the payout for USD CAD on y'all's brokers? 70 on IQ Cent. 70 on IQ Cent, 74. Okay, bet, bet. Okay, so I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm not gonna take this trade because I don't trade underneath seventy. Um, but if y'all want to take this trade, I will give you my coordinates, my entries, and everything of that nature. Um, so y'all do have that freedom to take that trade. Um, where I would personally enter, uh, actually no, don't take this trade, family. 
we got we got one more minute until you know this this next candle pops up. If we get a, if we get an up arrow on this next candle, we about to be lit. We get an up arrow on this next candle. If we can get a little, yeah. Wait till the next candle. Wait till the next candle, right? Um, oh, so while I'm getting into this, right? Let me go ahead and tell y'all, you know, the settings that I use for my trades too, right? So option type, you know, while we're waiting for uh, this next candle to present itself, right? Um, the option type is going to be turbo. Um, your time is going to be on three minutes. Um, I have my fixed time on, um, you know, your amount, your profit, whatever it is that you want to use. Um, and, you know, when I roll, when I, I decide to roll over, I'll let you know and everything of that nature. Okay. So we got 74, 70, 60, right? Um, I personally wouldn't take this trade just simply for the fact of the payout. But like I said, it's a good setup. Um, and we have about one more minute until the next candle. So I'm going to go ahead and continue playing Kodak until uh, we're ready. So let's get it. I represent. I got lots of growth. That's why I'm arrogant. In the club, popping with my niggas. Kodak pop. All my love, rocking on them jeans. On them money. You ain't talking money, I don't hear you. You ain't got to touch my own feet. That's blue. That's blue. So we got the new candle that just opened right now. Um, currency strength, the CAD did get a little bit stronger. So now USD and CAD are equal in strength, which is not ideal. Um, honestly, family, if you want my honest opinion, like I said, I don't necessarily take trades where the currency strength is not on my side. And right now it's currently on, not on my side. So I wouldn't take this trade. Um, you know, personally, like I said, I'm super conservative. I'm super, super careful. You know, if the trade goes in the right direction, cool. Right. I'm not scared to miss out on a trade because I, if I went with my analysis and I lose the trade, then I'm going to be sick. Right. Cause I'm going to be, I'm not going with my own plan. Right. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and just move away from USD CAD. Like I said, it looks nice. I like the setup, but currency strength is just not on my side. And that's one of my heavy confirmations. If you want to take that chance to take USD CAD, the opportunity is there. Um, the entry that I would take if currency strength was on my side would be 403. Okay. So if you want to take that for a three minute call, um, you're more than welcome. I'm not taking that trade. Okay. But it is there. So with that being said, I'm gonna continue to move forward. Um, what does fixed time mean? Okay, bet. I'll, I'll explain that right now. There's a way better currency tool, right? So fixed time, what that is, is basically, okay, so if you have fixed time off, okay, I'm gonna break this down real quick. So if you have fixed time off, okay, you're gonna see something on your broker that says purchase deadline, and you're gonna see something that says expiration time, okay? And then on the top where it says the pair that you're actually trading, you're going to see a little timer. Okay. So this is when fixed time is off. So basically if you were to enter a trade right now, right? So like I'll enter a little dollar trade, right? Cause I'm not tripping. Right. But I'll enter a little dollar trade, right? If I was to enter a dollar trade right now, I'm not going to be in the trade for three minutes, how my time is set, right? I'm going to be in the trade for whatever time is up here. So if I enter a trade right now for a call, right, I'm going to be in this trade for two minutes and 16, two minutes and 16 seconds. Okay. That's basically what fixed time off means. Now, if I have fixed time on, it means I'm going to be in the trade for exactly my time expiration. So if I'm in the trade for three minutes, I'm gonna be in the trade for three minutes rather than the time that they give me here. That make a little bit more sense, family? That makes a little bit more sense to drop a seven. Right, it's an app called Currency Heat Wave. Okay, cool. As though I, I've never heard of it. That's just the currency strength that I use. All right, I'm just be real with you. Cool, but glad that makes a little bit more sense. So with that being said, um, let me just look at this currency strength real quick. Let me move this down so I can click this while that's popping up. Right, we're gonna go here. Right, so currency strength. Uh, we still have USD CAD equal, Euro CAD equal, Euro USD equal. So basically, the only trades that are gonna be probably going in our favor is gonna be Euro JPY and USD JPY for selling opportunities. So if we don't see anything like that and currency strength doesn't change, you know, I'm not going to be too confident in the markets. If you want my honest opinion, family, I do trade a lot during the morning. 
that's when I'm most comfortable, but I do trade at night as well. You know, we did have an undefeated session last night, but you know, I'm just be real. If you use cash trap, it's a lot more volatile and a lot easier to use in the morning. It's just going to be chill, right? So if you have work in the morning, wake up before you go to work and trade. It's going to, I promise, it's going to help you out. But um, let me go ahead and play music again. Put a different song on. Let's play, let's play plug, right? Let's move forward. Let's get it. I used to be the only one in our class that knew about Canva. I'm not listening to an ad. Sorry, can't do it. I just killed my vibe and we back. Mm. I was jugging for nesting and fix till I ran into the plug. I got the key red up in the Louis V. Now they calling me the plug. I'm out in Guatemala with a quarter million dollars fucking with the plug. Touchdown on a nigga, boy, stack, then I brought it to the plug. For nothing, I'm jugging the plug. In the trap, make a play like quarterback. Touchdown on a nigga, I'm taking your sack. I came off of one ground. Now I pull up the blue lamb. How to break the trans down. The kitchen, I turn it to Michael like this, and I take in the pot and I beat it. I'm mixing the chemicals, turn to a chemist, the people that call me a genius. I was 13, ran up on the plugs, taking them up for the drugs. Yeah. Pull up in the rape and I'm pouring the pipes in the mud. Yeah. Rushing the pot like white water. I feel what they calling me flipper. They calling my Motorola for zippers. I'm all in Jamaica with strippers. Woo. Honey man, honey man, too. Uh. Me real money, hit a lick on the plug. More money, I'm blood. Motorola still with Riotta. Your nigga, they call me the plug. Yeah. I was jugging, finessing, and flex till I ran into the plug. Cool. So if we get a down arrow on UJ right now, this is setting up for a, a, a good opportunity to sell. Um, the reason being, you know, we're approaching a red Bollinger band, which is used as an area of resistance. Um, we have, uh, you know, this indicator here, which is going above the dotted line, likely to reverse. Um, and then we have, you know, this indicator here as well, crossing above the dotted line. Currency strength is on our side. Um, JPY is currently stronger than the US dollar um, by one bar. And then we have our purple line going in the opposite direction. Where I would enter this trade um, is around the three, 368 area. So UJ for a 368 put. Um, payout on race option is 70%. Let me know what the payout is for y'all. Um, but yeah, so UJ, I'm gonna say, like I said, three, 368 area, right? So there was a spike just right now. Some of y'all might have entered. Let me go ahead and put this back up. If you got in at 368, 369, you're currently in profits. Shout out to y'all. Let me know if y'all get into the trade and where y'all entered. Three sixty eight put UJ. Just make sure we're still solid. Currency strength is still on our side. Y'all. Three sixty seven. The three sixty eight right now. I'm gonna go ahead and enter. Gave me a trash entry, 367. Well, not too bad, but okay. We got a little spike up. Let's look to see what's happening. Price is lower on here. Okay. Come on, currency strength. Don't play with me. UJ, still good. All right, so we're sitting at the 368 area right now. We're just looking for a drop. Like I said, you should be entering for three minutes. Fixed time is going to be on. A little spike up. So, <laughs> right. Got a spike up. Let's see what's happening. UJ, UJ. Let's see. 
Okay, it's chilling a little bit up there. Let's see, let's see. My, my computer is mad slow right now. We're, we're sitting at 366 right now. Sitting around entry, all right? I don't really like when price sits around entry, but you know, we're in the trade, so we've got to deal with it. Still good in strength. Where's UJ at? Come on, come on. We're sending an entry. Now we're getting somewhat of a downward move, a little spike. Let me know how we are doing. Let me know how we're doing. Yo, why is it not clicking UJ? Come on. <laughs> Cash trap is playing with me right now. We are in profit though. If you got in around the 368 area, we have about another sheesh. Nice little spike upwards. I'm not gonna roll over. If you have the option you want to if you want to roll over, you can make that decision. All good. It's playing right now, facts. Cleared. Shout out to the clear squad. If you cleared, let me know in the chat. If you clear, go ahead and drop some money bags in the chat. I still have about another 20 seconds in this trade. We'll see what happens, right? But it's looking good. I, overall, like I said, price is, you know, it, it's playing around a little bit right now. But, you know, I, I overall feel like we're going to get a spike down. It's going and, and it's going to put us in the right direction. If you cleared, though, shout out to y'all. Clear game, right? Currently an entry, don't play, spike me in, get me in there. All right, I'll take the L. I'll take the L if y'all can take the if y'all can take the dubs. Okay, I'll, I'll take the L if y'all can take the dubs. That's easy. That's 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 light work. But if you cleared, you know, go ahead and drop a money bag or money sign, whatever it is that you have. I did not clear. You know, I'll take that L. Like I said, we take lessons. I love lessons, right? But it's all good. I just I don't know why my hourglass wasn't loading. Why I was not loading UJ, but if you clear, let me know in the chat. Some of us cleared, I did see. Is UJ gonna load now? UJ does not wanna load. UJ does not wanna load for me. Sheesh. If you did not clear, let me know. Okay, someone said, appreciate you, appreciate you. I'm glad y'all are clearing. I, I, like I said, I'm not worried about me. I'm worried about y'all, right? But UJ overall was a good setup, you know? Cash trap is not 100% as you've seen, um, you know, uh, cash trap from February to, you know, last month, you know, is 89.9% accurate. So, you know, it's, it's not 100%, but it is super accurate if you use the confirmations and such. Finally, UJ wants to load for me. Let's see what we have for UJ. Um, currency strength is still in our favor though, but we didn't necessarily get the drop that we we're anticipating yet. We did get another down arrow. Uh, it's smooth. It's all right. It's cool. It's a, it's a, it's a good, you know, it's a good setup still. It didn't necessarily make the move that we're anticipating yet. Um, you know, it's going to happen. The, the, the sell is going to happen when the sell happens. It's, Hey, it's all good. You know, if we take the lesson, we take the lesson, right? But uh, the, the setup is there. You know, we have the confirmations. We have the down arrow. We're on the Bollinger Band. We're going away from the purple line. We're above the red, uh, you know, our strength, uh, strength index on both the RSI and the stochastic. You know, we're both there. It's just about it making the move now. You know, we have the confirmations. That, that right there is a six confirmation trade. You know, that's, that's the perfect setup. It just has to find the point in which it's going to reverse now, right? But if you took the lesson, I do apologize, but you took a risk with, ta with taking the trade. But with that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and play the music again. I'm gonna look for another setup, see what we can find. I'm gonna let's go. I got the key red up in the Louis V, now they calling me the plug. I'm out in Guatemala with a quarter million dollars fucking with the plug. Touchdown on a nigga boy set, then I brought it to the plug. But you know our bag, Ralph Simmons bag, Perry Ellis bag. 
Call my phone, I bag it. Bought my whole some ballots. She know that I bag it. Hey, yo, Jer, I had a barrel. He know that I bag it. I'm gonna move that traffic. Can't let these hoppers have it. It's snowing in my head. It's snowing in my My block too hot for all that shit. So you don't want no ass. Niggas get the blast and man down somebody bag it. Designer jeans, I cash and let the nigga have it. Probably file is always up in magic. Hey, bitch, I love him, have it. She know that I bag it all. He mad cause she bag it all. I was jugging, finessing, and flexing till I ran into the plug. I got the key red up in the Louis V. Now they calling me the plug. I'm out in Guatemala with a quarter million dollars fucking with the plug. Touchdown on a nigga boy stack, then I brought it to the plug. I'm balling on you niggas, don't nobody fuck with you cause you a scrub. 30 inches on that G body, nigga, I don't ride dumb. So Euro JPY, um, this pair from B, if you haven't traded Euro JPY on, you know, uh, HFX binary options, it's a very, very, very spiky pair. You know, something you do need to be cautious of. But the setup's here. You know, we're at the Bollinger Bands. Um, you know, we have a down arrow. We're above the red dotted line here, looking to cross down. Red dotted line, cross, uh, looking for the cross down. Um, simply just waiting for the next candle. Um, currency strength, as you can see, is there as well. Euro is significantly weaker than the Japanese yen. So the 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 you know the analysis is there. We're going in the opposite direction than the purple line. If we get a down arrow here, I'll give you the entry that I would personally take. Um, so Euro JPY, let me see what the payout is. 85%. Let me know what the payout is for your broker for Euro JPY, but I do like the setup. Um, you know, just be cautious. It is a, a whole <laughs> <laughs> I'll play. I'll play Kodak once we get in, right? But um, you know, the entry that I would take would be somewhere around seven sixty. That's a very conservative entry. Um, so I would look for seven sixty or uh, yeah, seven sixty for an entry on Euro JPY for a put. Um, that's what I'm gonna be looking for. Race option is bro. My race option has been geeking. I need to switch. I'm gonna honestly go to IQ Center. That's what I got my whole squad on, and I don't even got it. Everyone on my squad loves IQ Center too. But like I said, three minute put at 760. Looks like price is already dropping. So if you got in, uh, I never went up to 760. Let me see. Euro JPY. 760 has not hit 760 yet. So we're still looking for the entry three minute put. Make sure your fixed time is on. I'll lower this a little bit. We'll go seven. All right. 760. Now we're getting a little bit of a, of a push to the downside right now. Confirmations are all there. If we can get a pullback to the upside before we get this big drop, that would be absolutely beautiful. 760s area. I don't know why I reloaded this. This takes forever to load. 760s. Might be taking off without us. If so, it's all good. But it's a good setup. It's a good, good setup. Might be taking off without us. I'm gonna be honest with us. With y'all family. 760. Yeah, it's, it's definitely leaving us. Sheesh. All good. Well, let's see. Let's see. This DJPY. It's nice. It left to the dump chunk. Sheesh. Thanks. I'm going to play music while I'm looking again. Really, I'm no plug. Call that why you do me like that. I just want a little love. No bitch, I'm a thug. Nigga, I already know what's up. So don't try to dap me up when you see me in the club. 
She say, baby, you ain't gotta run, but I already caught my nut. What you expect? I'm booted up. I told her, leave her shoes at the door. I better not catch you stepping on my rug. Oh, I'ma wet you up. I was jugging for Ness and Till I ran into the plug. I got the key wrapped up in the Louis V. Now they calling me the plug. I'm out in Guatemala with a quarter million dollars fucking with the plug. Touchdown on a nigga boy stack, then I brought it to the plug. Definitely took off without us. Alright. I'm gonna have to play. Come on, bro. You know what I'm coming for. Come on. I need the remix too. Don't play with me. Thank you. Crap, Taco yeah, Bell. So. Not playing an ad. It's not what we're here for. Thank you. Get it. Remix, little bitch. Hey. No Let's get it. Big G K shit. Bow. 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 Hold on. Look. Big drip. Big drip. I'm gonna love with a lip, bitch. Ayy. Crip shit. Ayy. She wanna suck on the lit dick. Ayy, ayy, ayy. Couple bitches I get lit with. Couple bitches I get lit with. I bit spit. I give a fuck who you bit with. Ayy, ayy, ayy. Bow. They loving the style. They loving the style. Send me the Addy, I'm hunting them down. Send me the Addy, I'm hunting them down. <laughs> All of my ops is targets. See the red dot, no target. Big drip, don't slip, I'm sorry. Spin the block, hellcat, no roaring. Little bitch, don't fuck the party. Big drip, big play, eat it up, no starving. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Lit bitch. Lady, she fuck for the bag and the lit wrist. Her lips look good, but don't kiss. Drop my top, I'm skirting. Bulletproof black excursions. Bulletproof demons. Shake them off, shake it. Then I go to Sunday service. Perky, Perky, Zanny, that's crazy, crazy, Skirt. Mercedes, Woo. McLaren, Lamb, fuck you, pay me. Uh. She want the white like Shady, Shady. no Perry, white. that's Katie, white. Big Ice, they skating, skating. Big Dip Splash, Navy. Bitch, me on baby time, 24 in cars in a line. I let her ride around, if they catch you with me, you some kin of mine. Hey. The bullshit I minimize, I got the Glock inside. Bow. Hope you don't try, Bow. Bow. it's a homicide. Bow. Bow. Shooters with me. I don't give a fuck if you grew up with me. You heard he did that. What? You gonna hear when he get wet. Everything is 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 not really setting up for this necessarily for this candle necessarily. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and look at you know other type of pairs. I'm gonna look at like GBP USD. I'm gonna look at NZD USD. See if we can find anything. Let me just look to see um, what payouts are GBP NZ. USD 80. Cool. Bet. Baby, baby. I go to your store crazy, crazy. She trying to get in my savings. She don't need work, that's crazy. Damn, hey, she hey, hey. Hey. Big, trip. Big trip. I feel in love with a rich bitch. Hey. Kick shit. After I nut, you can dip, bitch. Hey. Right wrist. Bust down. Oh, yeah, you lit. Hey, hey, hey. Left wrist. Bust down. Oh, you lit, lit. Hey, hey, hey. 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 Bitch, I'm on TV time. TV time. Straight forward, I don't need a line. I don't. I just wanna watch it the free time. I did. I bought it with me, I ain't leaving mine. Bow, bow. I bought it with me, I ain't leaving mine. Shoot it with me. I give a fuck if you coolin' with me. You say you ain't GDK. What? What the fuck is you doing with me? Hold on. With me. Yeezys. I need the money and pretty. Hey. This bitch tell me that she need me. Hey. Fuck I don't like the way you treat me. Hey, hey, hey. Figgies. I'm giving number figgies. I'm giving number figgies. Oh. man person. They believe me, yeah, yeah, yeah. Bitch. Free souls are here, demon. Hey, geek the geek it. Hey, we winning, we on defense. Hey, she let me fuck on the wing. Hey, show you a baddie. Baddie, she try to add me. You cannot have me. You cannot have me. No, Lil mommy, I'm married. Lil mommy, I'm married. Oh, cat family, there's literally like nothing that is like beautiful right now like i said i'm i'm not the type to force a trade or anything of that nature i look for literally six confirmations and if i don't get the six confirmations I'm, i don't even really feel too comfortable taking the trade um and i'm looking at you know pairs that don't even let the arrow pop up and i'm not even really seeing too much um 
you know, let me just do currency strength, update it again, see if we got anything different. Euro odd. I mean, I've never even, I haven't traded high frequency euro odds. So I don't even feel comfortable going into it, but, you know, I want to find something that's going to allow y'all to, you know, get a, a crazy profit, you know? So I'm going to look at euro odds. You know, I've traded it on Forex, but I haven't necessarily traded it in, uh, you know, binary. So I'm not seeing too much in the market right now, though, if I'm being honest. You know, the only trade that, yeah, this it's not really setting up for nothing crazy right now. Look, how about this? How about I, how about I give y'all access to something, right? You know, let me, let me ask you this, family. How many of y'all are gonna be up? You know, I'm 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 pretty sure the majority of y'all are gonna be up at midnight, right? Drop a seven if you're you're gonna be up at midnight tonight. All right. Well, my 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 organization, my team, my mentor and such, you know, we we do midnight sessions, right? We call them we call them a midnight snack. All right. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna show you so you can see it and such. Um you know, we have a call going on right now, a little training. Um, but let me find it. Okay, they they still on this call. Bet. So I'm I'm missing my mentors call and stuff right now, but it's all good. But um, we're gonna have a session tonight at midnight Eastern time. Um, it's gonna be a midnight session or a midnight snack live HFX training. Um, and like I said, I don't typically trade at this time, so I mean that might be part of the problem. While I'm not you know, my confirmations and such aren't making too much sense or not, not too much, not that it's not making too much sense, but maybe that I'm not seeing the things that I want to see. Um, so drop a, you know, let me just let me know in the chat box if you want me to, you know, send a tally the link to that midnight call. So I can make sure that y'all, y'all get something, right? Cause we only really took one, one, two trades, right? But, you know, I want to, I want to give y'all access to that and such, right? So, <laughs> bet, so, I'm gonna give y'all access to that. Um, once I get the link from, you know, the guy that's gonna be hosting it tonight, I will send it to Natalia. I'll make sure that y'all get on the squad or y'all get on. You know, the call yesterday that we had, uh, we had my mentor Malcolm actually host the call and we went eight and, or I went personally eight and O last night with him. I'm not saying you're gonna go eight and no. I'm not saying that you gonna you gonna you gonna take the trades from this session. I'm not saying over leverage. I'm not saying anything of that nature, right? But this is just gonna be another opportunity for you to make bread, right? We weren't able to, you know, do some some crazy stuff on this session, right? I, I genuinely feel like it's. I look at you, Jay, right now. I got you, but you know, I genuinely feel like it's not necessarily too much going in the market right now. UJ is setting up for a nice sell. Shout out to you. Shout out to who, what was the name? The greatest ever? Greatest ever, UJ is setting up. Right, UJ is setting up for a nice little sell. We just open, okay. Okay, show you, I'll see you, I like it, I like it. Right, where I would enter, 387 UJ three minute put, that would be my entry, 387. Personally, like I said, very conservative. Three, 387 UJ put, Fixed time on, right? We're currently sitting at 386. Sheesh. If you got in around the 391 area, 392 area, you got a nice little entry. Like I said, 387 um, or higher is what you're going to be looking for. But yeah, everything looks nice for you, Jay. I like this. Shout out to shout out to the greatest ever that, that, that said that in the chat. UJ looks good. UJ looks good. So if you get a spike to the upside at around 387 or higher, um, you know, that's a good trade I would take personally. Me personally, right? The, the last high was at 391. So if price gets back to 391, I'm going to enter. 387 is where I would have entered, but I'm personally going to be looking for an entry at 391, right? For it to retest that high. If it retests that high, I'm going to enter. If it, it goes back to 387, I'm not going to take the trade, right? So me personally, 387. Right, but that's a good entry. Like I said, I will still give Natalia the the link. I'm gonna go ahead and enter 392. Thank you. So we should be entered. Some of us should be entered. If you did not enter, um, that is a, a a good area to enter 392. It's currently sitting there. Um, but I'll make sure that Natalia gets the link to that to that midnight call, so y'all can get access to that. It's gonna be in about an hour. So. 
get it. But I'm gonna go ahead and play music until then. Uh, I will play Grace. It's a good song. So let's look at what Price is doing. Sitting the entry still, a little bit above, right? Come on. I should just play my Apple music, honestly. That's what we're gonna do. Yo, my internet is tripping right now, bruh. Y'all can still hear me right though, family. I might be lagging a little bit. He said PP Wi-Fi. Come on, come on. Stop playing, bruh. All right, we're just gonna go to download the music then. Cosmo. Should be in profits if you got in at 392. Yo, why is my music not playing? This is a downloaded song. Yo, my music is just tripping. I'm gonna just leave it at that. We just not gonna play no music. But we're at entry right now. Nothing crazy going on in the market. So I'm gonna make sure currency strength and everything is still good. UJJ is still stronger. Got our confirmations here. We're going away. From the line, we got to push up to the upside right now. Yo, this is not like beautiful. I'm so confused. Why this is not pushing down right now? This is crazy. This is crazy, family. Oh my goodness. That's beautiful. I just, I, I start beatboxing. <laughs> Yo, price is really just playing right now. <laughs> I'm dead because y'all y'all probably looking at me like, oh, this this dude. <laughs> yo, I don't. Yo, I, I'm done. For, I'm I'm not trading at night more no more. Natalia, if you want me to do a morning session, I got you. But this night session stuff, this is not for me. As you, as you can see, this is. <laughs> yo, this is not it. Yo, this is mad. This is crazy. I've never, I've no, oh, wow, okay. The conf, the thing is, like, I, I don't even know what to tell you, family. Like, the confirmations are all here. That's why I'm confused. Hey, it's a lesson. It's a lesson session. I'll take the lessons. Like I said, if you got broke, you, you if you broke even, you know, shout out to you. If you happen to catch a little spike down, shout out to you. But I'm gonna make sure y'all get the, I'm gonna make sure y'all get the session for midnight, you know, I'm not doing too much tripping. Uh, you know, like I said, I'm a morning trader, uh, but you know, no excuses. You know, we took, you know, me personally, I took a few L's today. I'll take the L's, but I take my L's as lessons. I make sure that I always learn from them. You know, I learned my lesson today, you know, stay in your, not, not in your comfort zone, but stay what your, you know, to your plan, your discipline plan, you know, trading in the morning. That's my personal plan and things that I do. Um, but with that being said, family, you know, I'm going to go ahead and, 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 you know, give it back to Natalia. Um, let her go ahead and close the call for y'all. Like I said, I'll be making sure that she gets the link to um, the midnight call. Uh, like I said, we've been doing this for the past, you know, few weeks. We've been having some crazy sessions, been going absolutely dumb at midnight. So I'm expecting nothing less. Um, but with that being said, family, you know, we had the setups, we had the now since we had the confirmations, you know, the market was not moving in our direction. I'll take the L's for that. You know, I'll take full on responsibility for y'all's lessons and my lessons today. If you happen to, you know, learn anything new or anything of that nature, you know, shout out to y'all. Hope y'all y'all learn something, you know, like Natalia said at the beginning, no takers are money makers. One thing I, I'll tell you when it comes to this business, you know, I've been in the business for two for two years now. I'm gonna stop sharing my screen, right? But I've been in the business for two years now or almost two years now. Um, and you know, it's a journey. You're going to learn a lot. You're going to learn a lot about yourself and you're going to get a lot of opportunities to grow and become a better version of yourself throughout the process. Right. So take every lesson, take every, you know, failure, take everything that you get and truly run with it. Right. At the end of the day, um, for sure. I'll make sure Natalia gets the link for the morning sessions too, but you know, I'm gonna leave you off with this and I'm gonna make sure Natalia, I'm gonna let Natalia close out the call, but you know, 
make sure that you 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 utilize the things that you really have around you right make sure that you're plugging into your go lot make sure that you're plugging into your academy make sure that you're plugging in with your mentor upline sponsor whatever it is right because at the end of the day the people that receive the most success within this market and within the business in total is the people that are surrounded by individuals that have the results that you want, right? I got into this opportunity for surrounding myself around individuals like Emery, right? Darwin, uh, 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 Rich Off The Net, uh, uh, Lizaldo, uh, who else? Uh, Ricky Valdez, Sherman Ten. Uh, uh, Drake, Dennison, right? Just different individuals and just surrounding myself and putting myself in position to, to really win, right? But with that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and pass it back to you, Nat. I'll make you back host so you can close the call and do everything that you please. Um, you know, wish we would have had, you know, a crazy session or something like that, but, you know, Mark and Dish didn't work out in our favor today. I appreciate y'all, love y'all. If y'all ever need me again, if y'all ever have any questions, y'all can reach out to me at officialkw underscore on Instagram. Um, anything at all calls questions anything like that i got y'all but let's go ahead and work you know i'm, I'm excited to celebrate y'all success and celebrate everything that y'all are gonna uh you know achieve and everything of that nature i appreciate you not for having me on and you know shout out to y'all so i'm gonna go ahead and make you host and the call is yours that awesome yo 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 y'all had some value tonight yo I need everybody on the, on the call right now. Go ahead and drop a C10 for Kobe real quick because he will C10 his body, right? Everybody drop C10 in the chat. Let's go, let's go. Show love, baby, show love. There we go, there we go. C10, your body, Kobe. Thank you so much for coming out and helping the squad tonight. We thank you over at Next Gen for reaching out. And I'm going to make sure y'all get that link for the 12 p.m. So if y'all want to get some nuggets, y'all want to make some bags tonight, make sure you are in the Telegram chat when I drop that. So I don't want to hear any excuses that y'all didn't get the link, all right? So another thing is tomorrow at, I got you, hold on. Tomorrow, I believe, hold on, hold on, hold on. I got you, I got you, hold on. Give me like two seconds. I got y'all. I'm getting there. Hold on. We have a call tomorrow, ladies and gentlemen. Y'all didn't know that. Tomorrow at yeah, tomorrow at 9 p.m. Not yes, thank you, Mars. Tomorrow at 9 p.m. You're gonna go ahead. I don't know who you're pointing at. Tomorrow at 9 p.m. Y'all gotta better get on that call tomorrow. <laughs> and then we have another call. We're gonna not we don't have a call on Thursday, but your girl has another call, y'all. If y'all want to see me and two other P5000s and a Chairman 10 call on Friday, let me see the money bags in the chat. Let me see some money bags, money bags, money bags, money bags, money bags. There we go. There we go. Yeah, we get a mad value tonight. Shout out everybody who on the call tonight. We were 43 strong. Now we're at 28 because everybody's hopping off with that straight. Thank y'all so much for getting on this call. Thank you for everybody who continued to be on this call. And we're going to keep running up, family. So, again, thank y'all and have a great rest of y'all nights. I will see y'all at 12 a.m. All right. Peace, family. Wow. Dot, dot.